Gunners, this is your host Kevin and Kelsey and we are out here having a pint. Today we're going to try Longest Day's Haze. Kelsey, where did we get that beer from? Well, you see, we were a special select group of people to get this beer early before the release. Only six of us, I think. Okay, so we're going to dive right into this beer, Longest Day's Haze. Man, I am ready for it. Kelsey, what? would you have a pint? What? What is that? So this is my this is my uh, pint glass. We're we're in Indiana. We're not in Germany. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, I mean, this is a little bit more of the pint. Also, this is like not this. That means you would have all of this and then some and not share. Yes, with that's me. right. I'm having all of it. That is not true. Okay. Well, forget that. Okay. So here's gonna be our pint glass, Indiana City. All right. First of all. Look at this artwork. This is the great, great artwork with Longest Day's Haze. It shows um, a girl, she's just in her hammock, just blowing a little um, flower. I don't know what he, even it's called. You don't know what, what is it called? Is. What, is, what kind of flower Those is that? dandelions. Oh, it's a dandelion. She's just uh, chilling, relaxing, having the longest day ever. So, this label art was actually done by the artist Lauren Smith. And you can follow her on Instagram, and she's under one of many Laurens. So hopefully we'll have it down here. Where where, where do we put the text at, Kelsey? Put the kick right here. Down. Oh, down here. Right here. Down. Put it right here. All right. Boom. All right, Kelsey, what kind of hops does the Longest Days Haze have? Featured hop in this beer is Enigma. Ooh, Australian too. So you're going to get tones of fruitiness. You're going to get tones of a simple, maybe even a raspberry. raspberry. Yeah, for sure. Alcohol by volume is 8.5. So a little guy like me, I don't know if I could drink 8.5s all day. Uh, Kelsey, what about you? I could drink one every day, but not all day. Every, every day. day for sure. Hey, have every day, all day. I'll drink, you know, all I don't day, even care. Every day, uh, You know what? I, actually, I could drink it all day. I mean, I couldn't do anything else. Don't, you know, well, like mow the lawn or anything, but. Uh, if you did mow the lawn, it would look like this. So. Yeah, yeah. It is a double dry hopped IPA with lactose. So I'm curious to see how that lactose plays out. So let's see how it looks, and let's see how the head looks as well all right look at that color look at that nice foamy head that is awesome so it's golden in color it's very bright um the head is very fluffy and it looks fantastic this beer is great looking the aroma let's see so the aroma very sweet very hoppy um i know right out the gate this is going to be bitter um uh, double dry hopped Let's see how it tastes. You know, for a double dry hop, sometimes you get that little, like, pepper, like, not burning, but really spice at the back end of your throat. Yeah. This one you do not. Mm. It's very clean, crisp. Yeah. So it's everything that you expect from Indiana City. Very clean, very crisp. I think they got some of the best IPAs and Pellels in Indy right now. If not, um, very high on the list. Uh, my top faves is Indiana City Brewing. Now, they only made 40 cases of this beer, Kelsey. I know, and it releases on Saturday. So if you want this beer, you need to get there as soon as you can on Saturday. Yeah, I don't know. I think they was giving, like, I don't know if they was giving tickets out or not. I'm not sure, have... but if I remember correctly, it said that there's no limits. Per, no limits. Per person. One person can get 40 cases. I'm almost positive. No way. I'm going to buy it all. Oh, man. Uh, reason? To go get in there and buy go it. Go camp. <laughs> get there at midnight. No. <laughs> now, if you do uh, Saturday pick this up, uh, four pack is $18, which is reasonable for a craft beer, especially like this. This is awesome. We, as OHAP, really want to thank Indiana City Brewing yep. for inviting us to come pick this up yeah. early before it was released. We really appreciate it, and we are such huge supporters of your brewery. Yeah, it was awesome. Um, they reached out to us and said, hey, you want to try this beer? And I ain't going to turn down beer. I'm like, hell yeah, I want to try some beer, and you want me to try some more? 
you know where you know where to reach me at. Hey guys, so if you like this video, uh, please push that like button and don't forget to subscribe to Out Here Having a Pint. We also have a podcast which is played on any of your favorite podcast channels. And not only that, you can follow us on Facebook. And then, yeah, and we also have a little blog. It's uh, outherehavingapint.blogspot.com. All right, that's it on Out Here Having a Pint. See you next time, you little craft beer nerds. Cheers!